सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक दिस अनदर क्वेश्चन फॉर जेई मेंस एंड वन सो बेसिकली इट इज फॉर मेंस बट कैन आल्सो बी आल्सो इन वन इट इज नॉट दैट टफ बट यस स्टूडेंट्स मे फाइंड डिफिकल्टी इन सच अ क्वेश्चन सो आई एम डिस्कसिंग इट इट इज फ्रॉम एंड फॉर स्टैट्स सो द क्वेश्चन गोस लाइक दिस देयर इज अ यूनिफॉर्म इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड एंड पोटेंशियल एट ओरिजिन इज बी एंड एट ए कॉमा 0 ए 0 0 0 0 0 0 c एट ऑल द थ्री पॉइंट्स ऑफ पोटेंशियल इज बी बाय 2 Now we need to find the potential at a comma b comma c. This point. Okay. So uh, first of all, understand the field is uniform. It is not saying the field is radial or something. Yeah, it is uniform. And at origin, at origin, you know the potential, right? It is b. And at a, b, and c, you know the potential. so for such a thing you first need to or uh, you know find some expression for electric field if it would have been radial we would have considered k q by r square or something like this but not here okay so it won't satisfy here now see if we go from 0 0 to a comma 0 0 we can say what uh, e equals to minus db by dr this we already know Yeah. So from here we can say the potential difference is v by two upon distance is a. The distance is a. Okay. So electric field can be written as this v by two a l cap. The x component of electric field. So basically we can write it as minus del b by del x partial derivative. So let us check. So we know electric field is in the direction of decrease in potential. So we have considered. Electric field to be like this for x value to be like this, and yes, potential is decreasing. Potential is e by two here, so of course it is satisfied. Similarly, we can have the other components as v by two b j and v by two c k by the same method. So this can be the net electric field. Which which is satisfying all the relations that you can see, or it individually it will satisfy. Okay, so this is the electric field which I have generated. It is not K Q bar square. This is the one. Now if I see the potential A B C, what will it be? Okay, so uh, again I will write. Uh, I am writing. Okay, I will write it. So again I can write E dot D R negative integration is equal to delta V. I can write that this. Now electric field is this. And uh, the distance now is how much? A I plus B J plus C K. Right? The distance is A I plus B J plus C K. I need to move from zero comma zero comma zero to A B C now. So again, E dot B R I am doing. So obviously, potential will be less at A B C because electric field is in the direction of decreasing potential. So I will. See, but the difference coming is i to i, j to j, and k to k. This is how you do the dot product. You will find v by two plus v by two plus v by two. So that will be the potential difference. This into a, this into b, this into c. So that will be the potential difference. How much? Three v by two. So at center the potential is b, and the potential difference is three v by two. And that is a fall because the electric field is in the direction of decreasing potential. So how much will be the potential at point C? It will be center V minus the change delta V. That means minus V by two will be the correct answer to this question. I hope the question is clear. So from E is equal to minus V by two, you only find the change delta V. You find the change. So this change is negative because electric field is in the Direction of decreasing potential. So this is the final answer minus two by two. I hope the question is clear. If you have doubts, you can leave a like in the comments. You can share the video with all your friends. We'll meet in the next class in the next video. Very good question. Ah, uh, okay. So obviously these are the fixed line that I say in the end. Okay. So keep practicing and all the best for your exams.